Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name is Oma and I'm excited to be back. Yay! My name is Oma. I'm a content creator. I have been creating content for the past seven years, but I create a lot more on my blog than any other platform. I mean, I'm still trying so hard to be consistent here, but my schedule is really crazy. Video editing is no joke, guys. Like when you've created content and then have to now edit it, it's a lot of work. So pending when I'm able to get that consistency here, to check me out on my blog. I always leave the link for you guys in the description box. And I write just about anything that pops into my head and that makes me happy. I'm going to make sure that I keep it consistent for you guys and make sure that you check it out. Again, I still make my content creating skills very useful on Instagram, especially on Insta stories. So even when you don't find me here, you don't find me on my blog, you don't find me on my Instagram feed, I'm definitely somewhere in my Instagram story. So make sure that you follow me on Instagram. It's at Oma263 and I definitely, it's at Oma263 and I have the handle somewhere right here on the screen. So make sure that you follow me. And I have the link, the direct link is definitely in the description box. Okay. So today's video, I'm not exactly sure what I want to target, but I know it's something that has been really heavy on my heart and it's really about reaching out. It's about friendships that have fallen apart and how you can just basically reach out to that person or why I feel like it's really important that you reach out to this person. It was inspired by a post that I saw on Instagram. It's Eva Tosin of Lesson that shared that content when they were just talking about how you fall out with someone and you just feel like, good readings. I really don't need you but the reality is you may never find that kind of friendship ever again and you just may need that person so why exactly are you feeling like I can't do with this person when in actual fact you may just need the person and that content really resonated with me and I thought I would just come here and speak on it or just add some more life to it really let's just talk this is me speaking straight from my heart now friendships are really really like the coolest thing ever but sometimes things happen and you guys fall out i mean i feel like i'm getting teary i've been like this for a couple of days now while i was reflecting on that content you guys fall out over the littlest things things that really shouldn't have been a big deal and instead of resolving it you just have like so many parties getting involved you allow your ego your pride you allow so many petty stuff get involved and sometimes we just allow this whole issue blow out of proportion and it just becomes like a really huge deal when in actual fact it shouldn't and so here's my thing you can actually reach out to this person and try to resolve whatever it is that you would have that is causing a strain in your friendship and try to rebuild your friendship it's really key and important that we don't just give up on friendships all this fake wokeness has got to stop and I feel the urge to also share how I'm feeling in this moment with you guys this is not like a regular video that I do but I'm happy I'm happy to just share with you because it's something that I was able to do this morning before I filmed this and I do feel relieved I do feel some type of way that well there's hope but one thing you need to understand also is you need to go into this reconciliation process with an open mind. You need to understand that the person may not be where you are. They may not be in the same space of reconciliation as you are. So you have to be willing to do the work. You have to be willing to go the extra mile to get this reconciliation a done deal. We got a done deal. Like, close the deal on it, irrespective of how the person may be feeling about you. You also have to understand that it's okay if you try a couple of times and the person keeps pushing you away. It means that that relationship is done and over with, but you will be happy with yourself knowing that you actually made the effort. So all of these different emotions that you may be feeling, um, sadness, unhappiness, you may be feeling pain, hurt, grudge, whatever it is, just be willing to release it just by reaching out to this person and trying to seek reconciliation with this person. This is not a regular video that I do. I don't even think I should have vlogged the topic. I just wanted to come here and share my thoughts with you guys. It's my way of coming back and... Um, sorry guys, I had a call coming. It's my way of sharing how I feel with you guys in this moment. And I hope that someone really is touched and moved to take a step to make a move and just reconcile with someone who they've fallen out with. 
So I tried filming this a couple of times and my memory space just kept failing me. But I'm glad that I'm able to share this moment with you guys. And I hope that you feel inspired to reconcile with someone and understand that sometimes you're not doing it exactly for that person. You're doing it for you. You're doing it doing it for your happiness you're doing it for a lot of reasons you're trying to get yourself the love the peace the joy you felt with this person um, you're trying to win back what it is that was there and you know all the good times and all the good moments you both shared and all the different amazing things and stuff that you were all would be able to do together so long as it wasn't a toxic relationship or friendship try to heal and try to reconcile with your friends stop giving up stop giving up on people all too easily all in the name of well if i lost you you'll never have me that's some yes you know let's let it go and um i hope you guys feel good as i'm feeling good right now i feel happy letting this off my chest and i'll see you guys in my very next video which shouldn't be as sober <laughs> As this one was this is really really not my not my kind of videos but i'm glad i was able to to do it all right thank you guys for watching and i'll see you guys in my very next video i love you guys and i remain on my check the description box for every information that you need about me and please to follow me on instagram oh by the way subscribe to my channel the more subscribers we have i think the more inspired i'll feel to film even more thank you so much for watching